we, we, <laughs> we're getting a lot of questions about whether if this comeback's real or not. Um, you know, I've, we've seen all the, the, the Tupperware containers you bought with you, but now we see you... Um, um, mm -hmm. Today is my high calorie day. Oh, okay. Because I diet strict all week. I have like one day where I eat chicken and rice. Yeah. Saturday and Sunday I eat chicken and rice, vegetables, oatmeal and that. And then Monday to Friday I have McDonald's and croissants. Is that like you're going through a, a bulking phase or... Um... No, no, no. Eat clean for two days and then anything you want for five. And it works. Mm. Look at me. Mm. It's almost like intermittent fasting, but this is like intermittent eating. Yeah, yeah intermittent dieting. Dieting mm. for two days. Mm. So you're doing it wrong for all those years. Mm. Mm. I got told the other day, when I put up I was doing 40 sets for buys and tries, that I'm doing it wrong and I'm not training hard enough if I can do... 20 sets for biceps and 20 sets for triceps. This guy, Dave, I think it was, told me. Dave, who in his name said he was an ex-coach yeah. and has 50 followers, he told me I was doing it wrong. Yeah. What, what do you hire him as a coach? Cause <laughs> <laughs> He's an ex-coach, I can't. Oh, okay. Well, maybe you might have to pay extra to lure him out <laughs> of... Um, um, Heavy machinery, biker, ex-coach. Oh, okay. But I was doing it wrong, you told me. If you can do that much, you're not training hard enough. Oh, well, too late now. But yeah. this is part of my comeback. An almond croissant. And, and do you think, you know, you need those extra calories because you've, you've incorporated a lot of that strongman mm -hmm. powerlifting? That you do, because a strongman eat a lot of food. Yeah, you know when you're doing the farmers' walks and the military presses overhead and deadlifts and that thing you set me up out there so I can sort of use the forklift and lift it up like a deadlift mm. and stuff like that. It's yeah, I find the extra calories do help me. And CrossFit, I guess they've seen you. Um, mm -hmm. You're doing a few box jumps out there and. Um, um, well, I can't wait till you finish off that little ninja thing you set me up. The ninja warrior course, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no. Well, the the first stage of it, you were, you were flying over it. Couldn't even see me. I was like a ninja. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like where's Lee? Like he's a fucking ninja. I can't even see him. Yeah. Well, Matt's been helping you out with that. He's <laughs> he's been showing you the art of ninja he's already, training. He's always ready there to catch me. No, no. We well, um. He, uh, we call him the ninja because he, um, he goes around stealing underwear off clotheslines <laughs> at night. <laughs> yeah, <over> his head. <laughs> I think it's black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, he hasn't been caught. He's been doing it for years. <laughs> um, so he's a ninja stealing underwear and cats. Yeah, just he's a cat burglar. <laughs> just um, jumping over fences and. Uh, <laughs> um, and he loves Sydney because um, he um, <laughs> he has to climb up balconies and stuff like that to, to get to some of the good stuff, so. In those new apartments that are falling down, I can just see him climbing apartments, reaching across the balcony. No, well, they're, the, they're the good ones because they've got cracks in them, so he's... <laughs> look through the wall. He, he can, yeah, look for the wall, stick stuff in the cracks to get um <laughs> to get a better... Puts his smack <laughs> on. <laughs> <laughs> to get... Yeah, he just... He wears his uh, overalls, like, what are you doing here? I'm just fixing up the wall. <laughs> just putting a bit of putty in there. <laughs> Where's his name tag? Matt. <laughs> well, he's like Spider-Man. He just um, sticks to the... <laughs> he's got his hard hat on and his clipboard. Just checking the walls around here. <laughs> when he leaves, it, like, it's a cleaner bean. It smells like ammonia. <laughs> Matt strikes again. Yeah. It's clever though, he's never been caught. That is one thing you've got to give him. Yeah, no, that's why we call him the ninja here. He, um, as blatantly open as he is and doesn't yeah. hide it. Yeah. In broad daylight. <laughs> yeah. No. 
other than a few um, few servers going up in smoke and um, <laughs> you'll, be on, you'll be on the um, bridge client next. <laughs> Oh, no, no, that's... they're all they're, they're all chained together on that, so they uh, can't get away. Um, unless, unless, um, um, you know, some uh, someone hangs their washing out on there, and I think you'll give that a miss. <laughs> no, there's lots of people go up there, tourists, uh, and they're all connected to the bridge, so they can't get away. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of Chinese tourists. No, no, no. He always goes down in the national parks if he wants to hunt backpackers. <laughs> <laughs> I can see um, Matt. Matt's been busy here with his artwork. <laughs> oh, look at this. Matt's been very busy. There <laughs> <laughs> you go. Can we... I don't know if I can't zoom in on this one. There we go. Yeah, wait up. There you go. He's even taken the time to put the hole in the top and the line around where the foreskin was attached. Yeah. He doesn't spare no attention to detail. Yeah. I can't remember who he said that was a, um, was it um, Craig or Darren or? One of those what, guys. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I think that washing was line, Tuesday night or. Washing or line number two at Bankstown. <laughs> <laughs> You know, people keep, mm. he takes a photo, then he comes back and moulds it. Yeah. He has hundreds of these. <laughs> yeah. You know, like serial killers take a piece of clothing, he takes the underwear, and then he sits up beside the underwear like that. Yeah. That was Dave <laughs> from Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, some people build model cars, he just <laughs> builds model slugs. <laughs> <laughs> to go with the underwear. <laughs> There's a photo of a person, they're slugging their underwear. <laughs> you know, like those memorabilia yeah. things. <laughs> In frames. <laughs> and he writes the time and the date and how it was. They come really quick. <laughs> What's that? What's that, mate? You want Lee to sign something? <laughs> <laughs> Next time I go into one of those memorabilia stores, I'm going to say, do you have the Matt, <laughs> do you have the Matt memorabilia? <laughs> they're like, what are you talking about? I say, oh my God. I should um get a few of these and take them home and buy a frame yeah, yeah. and put some undies in them and put them all around. <laughs> send, it, send it to him in the mail anyway. No. Put a fake address where it come from. <laughs> That'd be funny. You'd be laughing because you know about that I sent it and that would be opening it upstairs going, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I'll put a condom in there with flour and water in the end of it. <laughs> Thanks for the good times, Taiwan. <laughs> oh. That would be funny. We could play 